Madden 24 Patriot. Oh, my God. <laughs> Alright boys, now what I'm about to show you boys is the best offense you need to be running for Battle 24. Look at the best in the offense for right now, alright? Now look though, before we get into it, make sure you boys like, comment, subscribe, and look if you boys gonna catch me on stream, you know, doing my content, one of the best offense, best defense, all that good stuff. Make sure you boys follow me on Kick, link is in the description. And if you boys want to support this channel even more, you can to like donations and things of that nature, you can um, hit the first link in the description. It just goes to helping the channel a lot more, you know what I'm saying? Because I appreciate all the support. And plus, I need to get players and packs for the tournament Saturday for MCS. So, yeah, so let's get right into it. We all know what the best offense is. Offense playbook is just. Now, this isn't really the best offense, but there is multiple offenses you boys can run. I'm going to show you one, one that I run personally is Bunch. You can run Bunch, Bunch tight end. I said TE and Nas. I said TE is cool this year, but it isn't like it's it it like top like it, like it was it last year. So it, it can easily get stopped. Plus that PEC's play isn't really as good as it was last year. So no reason to really run tight up said TE that much this year. You know what I'm saying? So um, I think another uh, formation you boys can run. I see some people running Trey White Flakes, but what I'm going to show you boys is a few plays you boys. Candle run and match So first is out of bunch. Um, you can build an offense. The offense plays you look, should look out for out of the Jets playbook. There's a corner out there. Next play is Z spot, bench spot. White curl was good, but you can't the high ball passes and this year, so white curl is kinda out of the question. Deep corner is a double play for you to look out for and verticals. Alright, now next one. Bunch jump offset. Now the only really good thing of how I only good thing about this is that you can block your tight end and have that all on the same side, but other than that, I don't really see too many people running this offense because it's really not that good of an offense too much. They bunch TE is really good because it has PA over it, it has Z spot and it has triple out. It has a lot of good players you can bomb out of and you can hit the, you know, hit the flats and things like that. Now, well, let me go and show you boys this play deep. The NFL is on EA Sports, and we are in Silicon Valley at Levi Stadium in Santa Clara. Coming up, we got a good matchup on tap here, as it'll be the Buffalo Bills taking on the San Francisco 49ers. The kicker, Jake Moody, has got it teed up, and we are underway now from Santa Clara. And here comes a return from the middle of the end zone. Oh, good return up past the 30. Past midfield. Still going. One man to beat. And he will score. Touchdown, Buffalo. So how about that? You want to talk about coming into a hostile environment and just silencing the crowd. They just did it. Yeah, I can hear you. My kid is just making a lot of noise, bro. What's up? They've talked about having this type of a start, but I think they looked at Yeah, no problem. And yeah, that was kind of bullshit, though. That, that, that kept returning. was kind of bullshit. A lot of people are now going to say, okay, now your offense, will they be out of whack? No, not at all. Yeah, yeah, no, nah, no, nah, because they, they, because McKenzie, he went to the Colts and used off of McKenzie back there. So I said, fuck it. I said, let me just put a uh, jigs back there and see if we do something. So let's try this again after the kick return TD. Yeah. Here's yet another kickoff. What's up? And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape as they get it up past the 30. Yeah, yeah, I did. <laughs> I did it before I even started the whole thing, bro. I just went right to the depth chart and, and switched everything. Are you in game? No, you can do that. Oh shit! Then the fucked up thing is, <laughs> the fucked up thing is, you, you just caught me on my line. I wasn't even supposed to be there. Sometimes you just sit back and marvel at what he can do defensively. Speed, strength, quickness. He's the whole package. And that package just wrapped up the runner for a loss. And they take him down. The Bills get to him. 
multiple players combined for their team's first sack of the game. And I don't think this is the script they had in mind for their opening drive. This is third and long. Now whistles come in. We're going to get a timeout here by the offense. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Open man is Juwan Jennings. They get a big amount back, 18 yards, but they'll still look at a fourth down now. Fourth down try, here's Purdy. And looking for Kittle, but it's intercepted. Picked off by Micah Hyde, and he'll take it across midfield and down to the 48-yard line. I'm trying out a new playbook, bro. I'm just if you see me taking too long, because I'm trying to figure out some shit. Damn. Oh, yeah, yeah. You definitely need to re up there. <laughs> God damn. Now, this Madden right here, bro, is, is beyond. It's beyond trash to me up. So after the INT, it's Allen. The left side caught by Diggs. 17 yards. It's just so, clun it's so clunky as fuck, bro. to throw looks over and boom a guy that wide open he has to be thinking wait a minute this is some kind of a dream this is too easy yeah I had to put my mic on bro i can't even hear you from, but for the defense almost feels like there was a bust in coverage and now sean mcdermott's made oh shit my bad i didn't know what i was doing just now now hold everything here we're gonna get a timeout by the offense they'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter here's bass now for the extra point And it's good, and they have jumped out here to a quick 14-0 first quarter lead. I'm trying, yo, I'm trying out the Jets playbook and New England playbook. They seem like to be like the best ones right now. Oh nah, 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 nah. nah. Turn sets him up pretty good here, right at the 30-yard line. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. Yeah. It's kind of gut check time. They seem like they got like everything in there. Oh, shit. Fuck. Yeah, yeah. They seem to got like all the bunches and shit, bro. Decent verticals and shit. Concentration goes right to the football. This is something you've talked about. They got this play too, bro. Is it Mike Blitz or some shit? Samuel? Knock the ball free, take it away from the other team, and now you have that chance. There's <laughs> a little bit of deflation when they end up recovering it. They knocked it free, couldn't take it away. First time these two have hooked up this afternoon, and it's a first down. McCaffrey running up the middle, and nothing much materializing there on the first down run. He'll get a couple, and that's it. From the 44-yard line, here second down and eight. Purdy looking to throw. Oh, how you not get the sack? Oh my God! They're bringing a lot of pressure here already in the first quarter. Already sacked him once. Now they get in there and knock another one away. You think maybe that tuck rule being gone makes defenses a lot bolder? Yes, indeed. That time. Oh, you know, got me. Ah, oh. That should have been a catch, though, bro. All right, bet. And that's all, folks. Good work by this defense to hold things in check. 
That's what I'm talking about. Situation. Now remember, they were unsuccessful earlier in this first quarter. Going for it on fourth, they're going to try a second time. Purdy on fourth down. That's mine, thank you. Oh, his early struggles continue. Yeah, man, you've been away for a minute, bro. <laughs> yeah, you've been away for a minute. I can tell, bro. are going to have it here just past the 25. But they're certainly not giving much help to their defense, are they? Because for the second time... Oh, yeah, so you ain't really tripping. To run back out on the field early after bro, I've been doing so bad in this game, bro. I feel like I'm about to, like, punch my TV and shit. <laughs> Buffalo offense ready to go for their next time. <laughs> oh, shit, yeah. I got a uh, 60, uh, 60 something. Yeah. Nothing lead and the football. Right. Yo, I saw team. this 90 inch TV, bro. They'll buy some time right. Pass incomplete, but the flag. That's a PI? Oh, roughing the passer. Well, Charles, sometimes we talk about the lengths officials sometimes go to to protect star quarterbacks, but that one, that was tough to argue against. Yeah, and I'm sure that everyone's going to say, hey, we're going to administer the penalty the same way for all quarterbacks. Uh, but when it's a star back there, even more so are they going to be diligent about throwing the flag. First down, and they're going to throw with Allen. Harris has Damn. it over the middle. And he's tackled a yard short of the marker. Good gain of nine on first down. Just about every quarterback is trained to really look downfield first before you come back and make a nice safe throw. And in this case, that's exactly what he did. Found his running back, let him create some space, and it turned out to be a nice play for the offense. Ball right on the 50-yard oh, line. Here's second and a yard. From midfield, here's Allen. Ah. Oh, if I could have finessed that shit. <laughs> 14 nothing the score. This is the NFL on EA Sports. I was getting ready to throw him out of bounds, too. I saw him break open. I'm like, oh, shit. All right, bet. Yeah, now nah, I hate when niggas, like, Chew the clock and shit, bro. I hate that shit. They do, they do that spam. Yard, spam, uh, spam and shit. Damian Harris. A nine-yard touchdown run. And the Bills have moved out in front by three touchdowns. But shit, but I would have turned the game off, bro. I'm out. <laughs> yeah, I'm out, bro. <laughs> like, all right, deuces. Look, look, look. And then, and then they do this shit, bro. They do this shit right here. I'm going to show you. This shit I hate when they do this. I hate when they do that. And that was the ugliest hit stick I've ever seen. What the fuck was that? Oh, back up. Oh, shit. Damn. And this is where you have to know your quarterback and know how you actually have to reach him. Do you do it with a little bit of humor? Maybe you break the ice a little bit. Like, hey, didn't we practice in that color jersey all week? Not the one that you're throwing it to? Or maybe you have to be stern with him. But whatever it's going to take to get the message, it has to be done. He's putting the game in jeopardy. Oh, yeah. They, they, they loaded, bro. They loaded out there. They'll come to the line, eating over they had a cut to gain the first here. Oh, cook, cook. Oh, I think he said. On third down, it's oh, okay, okay. Ah. Samuel, and he is gonna have a 49ers first down by a cut. Yeah, when they added cook, I'm like, oh, yeah, they about to be. They about to be running it for a while. They're gonna give Kansas City a nice little run. Here's Purdy on first and ten. Oh, yeah, fucked up. Oh, what's up with that? Where my head stick at? Damn. All right. 
I got a chance to show it. As they've got the connection working, his second catch in a row, first down. And I don't think there's any question that this offense is going to need to hit on a few more plays like this. It's been a difficult first half for them, to say the least. And I do believe if they want to get back in this game, they need to start right Ah, uh, you tried to stick me up, yeah. I felt the pull on the control and everything. They'll be like, this nigga tried to take my ankles. As the first half clock dips inside of three minutes. Here's Purdy. Oh, that's good. This one caught by Kittle. And finally down he goes. As they right, I can't just score now. I got I can't just score now. Hold up. A very me. nice pick up of 33 yards. All right. Now a chance to make that big play really hurt. It's first and goal just outside the five. Purdy will set up to throw it here. Ah, touchdown nice. Gotta knock the rust off. Moody good with the extra point, and they'll cut the lead to 21-7. You gotta run that Kansas City D, bro. They got everything on there. So here's Moody back out there now to send this one away. This will be brought out from the middle of the end zone. And then the thing is, what what this right here is, is I don't I don't start running until I'm at like the 10, 15 yard like uh like accelerating. I don't I don't I don't press it until I'm at like the 10, 15 yard line. The Bills come to the line to start their next drive. Mm -hmm. Right now they're saying, hey, let's keep this going. Two drives, two touchdowns. Oh, I hit the wrong yeah, one. Fuck. All right, but I mean, play. this is the way you practice it. This is the you're way right. you rehearse it. But right now, the play oh. calling, they're locked in really well. And he takes us beyond the 35 before going out of bounds. A 14-yard gain there as they look to improve this 14-point lead. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. They'll bring a receiver in motion left. On first down, Allen. Ah! Ah! Uh, oh, yeah! Woo! Woo -hoo -hoo. Out of bounds. I think when they get back in the huddle, the question will be, why did you throw that one? The All right, let me, uh... Incredible all over him. The only thing he didn't do after he caught the ball as a defender was get his feet in bounds. That should have been a turnover. Now little try again on second down. And complete right side. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, 91 speed. Yeah. That's that, uh... He was a man. He was a man, right? Yeah. That kills man every single time. Just that that one route kills man every single time. It seemed like they maybe given up momentum. Not so fast. No, not at all because they end up pushing the lead up once again. And you're exactly right. Thought momentum might have been shifting. Instead, they grabbed old Mo. Didn't let him get to the opposite sideline. Extra point by Bass. Up and good. And the lead now to three touchdowns at 21. To the touchdown, Bass to kick it away. Returning from his end zone is Ray Ray McLeod. And this return will net positive as he gets past the 25 and up to the 27 yard line. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. They're down three touchdowns to this point, needing to put something together as they have it first and 10. Yeah, uh, that's that tip drill, bro. Gotta be careful with that. Gotta be careful with that. Take over a couple of yards shy of midfield. Well, there are several factors at play for why they face this deficit right now, Charles. But 
Well, that's now three interceptions that he has thrown and just giving the football away pretty carefully. Yeah, about to say he's going to leave that open like that? Yeah, I know that all of our parents taught us to share as youngsters. But in this game, you don't want to share with the other team. Keep it for yourself. Keep it for your team. Got to cut down on all of those throws, those errant passes, if they hope to get back into this game. What the hell? What the hell is this nigga? Hey, you sure he ain't want to run? He won't get close to the Damn. Scrimmage. In fact, he's going to lose four yards. Nigga ain't want to run. The first play of the drive lost four. Now they'll look to move it forward here on second and 14. In motion, the tight end. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Boom. Now, Allen. Oh, no. Nah. Oh, no. Nah. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> and seeing nowhere to throw, he chucks this one away. Damn. All right. Let's see. Lead. Now it's third down. One thing you always worry about when he breaks the pocket is, is he going to take off with it? That time, the pressure was starting to close in. And he's just got to throw this one away. On third and long, it's Allen. Going deep for Diggs. And oh, my God, bro. That's crazy. But he could not reel it in. And that is not what you expect from a receiver of his caliber. Sometimes you get a little ahead of yourself. You don't look it in, and all of a sudden it's on the ground. A surprise to all. And this is going to hit the goal line and continue on in the end zone for a touchback. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. And the ball backed way up. So thinking with this amount of time on the clock, probably just sit on it, and we'll see these two teams go to the lockers. Yeah, I don't think you want to overthink it in this situation. Either side of the ball. Just go ahead and finish up the half and get on out and talk about it. On first down, Purdy. His throw incomplete. Well, this defense is certainly organized and playing off of each other because the rush is providing pressure and the coverage is forcing incompletions and capitalizing on mistakes. When you get every level on defense hitting at once, you get first half scores just like this one. He'll fire this deep for Ayuk. And his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today. I don't even know how that was intercepted. Yes, Oh, shit. All right, GG, bro. I better say it. This is third interception, and I'm going to use one of the most overused phrases in football. Yeah, I better say, oh, shit. I love the way that you called for the shot there. That's perfect, though, because... There is something to that. Being a safety often allows you freedom to roam around a defense, maybe not a specific assignment. Today, his assignment, find the football, and he's done so quite well. Uh -huh. Now a timeout taken. Perhaps a chance for one more quick play and then another timeout if they hurry. We'll see. Yeah. That's why I just post my shit on uh, I post my shit on YouTube, so I go back and watch it. Or did they take advantage of this spot to take a big shot downfield? To the air, Allen. Going deep for Diggs. <laughs> and it's knocked away and incomplete. Time for a break. We've hit halftime. Two quarters down. Two still remain. We step aside. This is the NFL on EA Sports. Welcome back. Charles and I settled into the booth ready for quarter number three. The 49ers going to have the football and trailing on the scoreboard as we get back underway on EA Sports. Here's McLeod from his end zone. And no chance to get away as they'll get him down at about the 17-yard line. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. 
Well, they look up at the scoreboard facing that deficit. A three-score game, Charles, but look, there's plenty of time to go here. The old football cliche that comes to my mind is you can't get it all back at once. They Yo, I cannot hit stick you at all, bro. I don't know what it is. Are you trying to say that there's no three-score drive on that play sheet for any of those coordinators? They just don't have it, right? You're trying to get it all back. You know you Where am I at? Oh, my God. But maybe cut into it a little bit. Oh, just, oh just, my just, God. I know you thought it was a pick, too, didn't you? And then maybe that'll carry over. First down, San Francisco <laughs> to pick up 14 yards. Oh, you got Lance out there. That's mine. And trying to get it to Samuel, but it's intercepted. Jair Elo makes a pick. Down the right sideline. Oh yeah, the, the, that that new that new style freeform shit. Yeah, it's stupid. And Charles, for this offense, those interception woes they kind of had in the first half have now followed them into the second half. And for this defense, they take advantage, turn that into a pick six. And that defense is in a spot now where they're thinking about ways to close this game out. And as confidently as they've been playing, I expect them to do exactly that. Tyler Bass now for the point after. And he's been a busy man. Five for five now as he knocks another one through to extend the lead. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six. And now the kick is away. Here's McLeod from his end zone. And they'll get him down right around the 25, actually the 26 officially. So a net gain of one there. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. But we haven't exactly been treated to a nail-biter in this one, CD. And if they cannot score here, this one's pretty much all but over. Are you saying that you feel like people are starting to think about getting out of here, maybe beating the traffic in order to get home or to their final destination? Uh, yeah, I don't think there's a whole lot of reason to hang around, especially if they can't score. Yo, yo, Madden 24, I'm telling you, Madden 24 is trash. It's, it's, it's really bad. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, 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 chill out. Whoa, whoa, sir. I'm going to need you to chill, all right? You're breaking way too many tackles. I'm going to need you to relax. Sometimes it's hard to believe, but there are times this game is about patience, isn't it? Has had the game he expected, but that run there, that may get him going. I was just going to say, maybe that gives him a little juice, because you're right, he struggled, especially in that Now Lance unable to escape, and down he goes. That's Gregory and, and that's a good play too. I think you gotta put, uh, if I'm not if I'm not mistaken, you gotta put Kittle on a streak, put your running back on like a a swing route, and then uh, I think, oh oh no, oh yeah, yo, you see you got me over here trying to, ah oh, motherfucker, <laughs> I'm over here talking, have my hand off the controller and shit. <laughs> Extra point <laughs> try now for Moody. It's good, and it's now 35-14. <laughs> now, if you put Kittle on the street, and if you got, if he got, if he got uh, tight end apprentice, you could put him on the corner route, right, and have uh, whoever the outside receiver is on a little fade, and then put the run, running back on like a, a swing route or a. Ooh, ooh, skirt, skirt. Or uh, a wheel route. Oh, yeah. Yo, I used to do, yo, I used to do worse with McKenzie. M McKenzie had a nice um, little stop and go, bro. Buffalo offense ready to go for their next drive. Still operating with a comfortable lead despite the score a moment ago as they begin first and ten. And he'll run yep. for about five. Up close Man, to I don't think he's got any. That's a really nice, tough run inside. And they gained five yards on it. And be frank about it, most offenses don't expect to get five yards on a play call like that. So when they do, they go back to their huddle with a little pep in their steps. They're starting to think that they're starting to dominate the line of scrimmage. 
Well, they'll run it here on the jet sweep. Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, uh. See, I'm just trying out shit, bro. I didn't know what was. I didn't know what about to happen. Brings up a third down. In my book, that's running the ball well, but with intelligence. Yeah. How about him keeping the clock moving, staying in bounds? Yeah, even though it's the third quarter, you're thinking ahead, aren't you? This is where your running game can really help you with a lead in the second half. I agree totally. It's not just end of the half situations that you worry about the clock. It's throughout the game. And with the lead, <laughs> I try to, bounds, try to sauce you up a little bit. He had the touchdown earlier. This one's going to get him a first down. First down, Bill. Oh, I ain't mean to do that. Fuck. Okay. Where are you? In motion is Hardy. Allen going to fake the jet sweep and the handoff and look to throw. Oh, that's a pick. Fuck. I don't know why he stopped on his route. This nigga's supposed to go up. Why he stopped? again. At their own 37 yard line. All right. San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. I kind of feel like they've reached a do or die point in this game, Charles. If they're going to try to pull off an impressive comeback, it has to start right here, right now. Oh my God, let me hit stick. Chance to get out of this situation, but they also understand they've got to move the ball and move it fast. In addition, they need to save as much time so they can get two more possessions. And they're not going to get to the line to run another play. So we will switch in. Ready, ready. Lance now on first down. Sliding out of the pocket. A poor decision there, and it's going to be intercepted. Jair Elo makes a pick, and the Bulletins are going to take over at their own 28 yard line. They exited the pocket. I felt, I felt the, I felt the little corner route coming, bro. I was like, yeah, it's about to be mine. And Brandon, when you're on the run, sometimes your downfield vision can get skewed. Oh, yeah, yeah. He should have let him out there, but. I told you, man, 24 is trash, bro. Man, 24 is horrible. You end up closing down part of the field and bringing those defenders to the ball. And that one was picked off. Let's go, Allen. Let's go, Allen. Stop and go. Stop and go. Give him 12 yards on that one. It earns him a Yeah, he kind of. He kind of slow in this so one. Finally, at this stage of the game, uh, he lets his legs carry him for a big time first down. But I think this is all set up by his eyes throughout the game. He's been taking it all in as he's watched this thing unfold. And oh, okay. finally, the eyes carry the legs. And yo, yo, field. kids be on some stuff, bro. My, my son, my son be ignorant as hell. He be like, Dad, you losing? Oh, it sucks, right? <laughs> They'll be like, yo, go to your room. You grounded. <laughs> Ah, yeah. Yeah. This is taken in at the five. And this, this is a, uh, I think this is the Jets offense, bro. I put, I put uh, the tight end on the street, and then I put the the running back on um a wheel. So still throwing here in the fourth quarter with a pretty sizable lead, and now that lead even more sizable. And if nothing else here, CD, a chance. You're getting a little too close to blocking this field goal. And he did just that. Brandon Convention tells us it's time for them to get off the gas a little bit, right? But you and I both know the yeah. receivers don't want them to because, as you noted, this is their chance to pile on the stats. If they got their way, they try to get every single spot in the depth chart points before this game is over. They had tackled at the 21 yard line, so a net negative there of four yards. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. Where we stand right now in the fourth quarter, this one pretty much out of reach. And Charles, I know they're going to be disappointed about several things with this ball game, but the self inflicted wounds, they've had several turnovers. You have to think that's going to be something they're going to discuss heavily in the film session in the coming days. You're absolutely right about that, partner, because Ooh. they're going to have to sit in that film room and watch every error that they made. I almost didn't click on, too. In the future, and mentally, I was going to let it happen. A lot of the guys are already starting to think about, okay, how do we put this behind us and get better for the next time out? This, they'll use as motivation for the rest of the time that they play to hopefully never be in this type of situation again. 
That was third down throw, but it misses the target incomplete. Yeah, I'm telling you, bro. Try and keep hope alive here on Man, 24 is trash, bro. Desperation time here. Oh, shit. You got it. And he'll be Damn. Taken down, but Good catch, though. Have first down yardage. Well, no reason not to try it there, and they do indeed convert on fourth. Mm-hmm. Lance now on first down. Y'all stop it for it, bro. <laughs> he's got it. It's complete to McCaffrey. And he's able to take it across midfield before going out of bounds. From the 48-yard line, here's second down and three. Again, they'll throw it with Lance. Eluding the pressure right. Is that a hit stick? That's not a hit stick either? Damn. Oh, uh, yeah, tap square. Yeah. She might get a touchdown right here. Yeah. Nah, I'm on PlayStation. And we are inside of two minutes left in this lock. Yeah, man. Affair. So from inside the 20, here's first and 10 at the 18. Working from the gun, Lance. <laughs> and this I get that? Oh. Uh, yeah, uh, man. It, I was playing with somebody on a PC not too long ago. Numbers, another incomplete pass that we just saw, and they're under 200 yards passing for the game, so they've done their job on that side of the ball. Yeah, recently I was actually working a game where a quarterback had a streak of five straight games without a 200-yard game, and that was a big talk. <laughs> that was my fault. And amongst his team, how do we get the passing game going? So big credit to them holding them under 200 today. It's a good gain of 11. Sets him up first and goal. Here's Lance. Forced out to his Oh, head. oh. Damn. I could have sworn I put the spy. San Francisco. Trey Lance. An eight-yard touchdown run. Oh, that's the spies? Yeah, as a matter of fact, that makes kind of sense. That makes sense, though. As they cut into this fourth quarter deficit. Moody good with the extra point. And that'll cut the lead back down to 21. Yeah. So after the made field goal by Moody, oh, he's shit. back out to kick this one away. And this is going to be returned from the middle of the end zone. And ultimately, he stopped right where he would yep. have been if he had I don't, I don't even mess with that play. At the 25. Mm -hmm. The Bills come to the line to start their next drive. Now they are really in the driver's seat here, enjoying this lead late in the fourth quarter. And the defense does have all three timeouts, but at this point, doesn't look like it's going to matter much. And he'll get it out to midfield. Let's see. Yeah, they'll spot it right. Yeah, somebody was killing me with these uh, with these wheel routes. Somebody was killing me with these things, bro. Back at the 25. And Allen is actually going to throw it here. And Davis with it left side. And that's good for a pickup of 10 yards. And they'll be left with a second and about a foot. Play action. Now it's Allen. That is caught. Kincaid with it. Who? Kim K. Second of their time is that? That'll leave them with just <laughs> one remaining in this fourth quarter of play. That one covers 29 yards. First down. Again, they'll throw with Allen. Wide open. This will be caught at about the five. Touchdown, Bills. Dawson knocks a touchdown grab from Josh Allen as his guys have opened up a very comfortable lead. Well, we know someone just added to his touchdown passing total, but all he did was get the ball out quickly to his tight end and let him take care of business the rest of the way. 
An extra point by Bass, up and good. And that'll increase their lead to 28. To the touchdown, Bass to kick it away. Here's McLeod from his end zone. A solid return, pretty good field position. They'll start at the 32. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. But we said it at halftime that they would need a nearly perfect second half to erase that deficit that they were facing, CD. But unfortunately, the second half has pretty much been a carbon copy of the first. Yeah, that early lead was almost insurmountable the way their opponent was playing. And, partner, they do have some good news, though. This one is getting close to being over, and they can try and hit the reset button starting tomorrow. Flushed out right. And to the 42-yard line here and brought down there. The 49ers now going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with 25 ticks remaining on the clock. Lance going to try and throw on third down here. Now a desperation throw deep downfield. And this is going to be intercepted. I mean, you threw a touchdown pass, but not to the wrong team, though. But you still did it, though. Nah, nah. <laughs> Isn't always pretty, but the interception there, that means that they should get out of here with a victory. Yeah, this is not a game that they're going to preserve for posterity on defense, but they did finish it off, didn't they? They did make the winning play to close things out. They'll take that one and head to the locker room. Oh, yeah. oh what? Now here's a pass on first down that's knocked away and incomplete. Well, their passing attack, even though that one was incomplete, has been really sharp in this one. It's resulted in a lot of touchdowns. And it looks like they're not going to stop throwing the football until the very end of this one. Well, that will certainly make everyone involved on offense pretty happy because that gives them all a chance. Oh, uh, wrong play. Wrong person. Ah, uh, catch that. Ah, let's go. And now with six seconds remaining, they're going to burn their final let's. timeout. So that changes things in a big way. Now from all the way down inside the 30, here's first and 10. He's going to go up top for the end zone. And he knocks the ball away, and it falls incomplete. I think it's fairly safe to call this game over, but they're still trying to bomb it downfield and add to their lead. Almost makes you start to feel for the defense and root for them a little bit, too. Ah. Ah, GG, bro. And the 49ers come up with a late turnover, but it will probably only matter to the statisticians as this ball game is now officially over. And as this defense walks off the field, they can do so with their heads held high. What a performance well, by, by the offense, too. I mean, really, Charles, just complete domination on both sides of the football here in this one. Certainly was, and I think both sides compete against each other all the time. You go to each other in practice, obviously your training camps, your offseason. But on game day, you both want to show your best. And I think that's what we saw from both the offense and the defense, a complete team victory. So that's a wrap for Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gunn, and this has been a presentation of the NFL on EA Sports. For more, check us out at easports.com. With that, we say so long from Santa Clara.